Today I'm making for you a brand new recipe. This is my fig and choc orange bliss balls. Absolutely delicious, a really healthy snack. I think you're gonna love it. So I'm using the uh, old school Vitamix Total Nutrition Center, the 5200. Uh, this is still the model I use at home today. It's absolutely amazing. Uh, so let's get started. I'm gonna start with one cup of nuts. I'm using almonds. You can use any nuts you like, it doesn't matter. All my measurements are down the side of the container there. When I make bliss balls, I want to be really accurate with my measurements, okay? Uh, bliss balls can overload your Vitamix easily if you do it incorrectly, okay? But not to worry, it's got an automatic safety feature. You can't possibly burn out the motor. So I'm going to put in some dried figs, okay? So figs are really good for you. They're high in minerals, antioxidants, and fiber. Um, and they're nice sweetener uh, too, so they're going to make the, uh, the bliss balls nice and sweet. So I just want um, two cups, uh, sorry, one cup of figs, one cup of nuts. And then I've got a quarter of a cup of dried seeds. Uh, this is called Pure Vita. This dried seeds, just like a trail mix, you can use chia seeds, doesn't matter. And then I've got two tablespoons of raw cacao, organic cacao. Beautiful, nice chocolate flavor. And I've got a teaspoon of orange zest, okay? So that's gonna give it that beautiful chop orange. Uh, you can add more if you like, it's entirely up to you, depending on your taste buds. And then I'm going to add some Himalayan rock salt. It's gonna bring out the flavor in the, uh, in the cacao, in the chocolate. And I've also got three tablespoons of coconut oil. Beautiful, all right. I'm gonna lock our lid into place, make sure it's locked in place, and I'm gonna start it on speed five, and I'm gonna pulse it about six times, then I'm gonna put it on low speed, work it up to 10, get it up to high, and use my tamper uh, when the machine asks me to, if that makes sense. You'll see what I mean when I start blending. Away we go. See that beautiful consistency now in the bottom of the container? How good does that look? So I'm gonna turn it upside down and I just rotate the blades and it should just drop out of the container onto the chopping board. Just like so, beautiful. And I have this beautiful, look at this, it's just like a dough, absolutely beautiful. I can roll that. Uh, with a rolling pin, I can make slices out of it. I'm gonna make bliss balls. So I just roll them up. Look at that. And then I'm gonna put some uh, shredded coconut over those to garnish them. Make them any size you like. Just roll some coconut into them. Beautiful, we have a delicious choc orange this ball. Look at that. Try some of that. That is absolutely amazing. I love this recipe. I can hardly talk. Make sure you try it at home. Happy blending.